What's up, my homeboys and homegirls? It's Jordine here once again with another real estate video. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys my real estate lookbook. Just giving you guys a little idea of some things that I'm interested in when it comes to how I dress when I'm out showing clients' houses and just like my real estate looks. Now, I have some pieces here. I'm not going to try all these on because I just don't feel like it, honestly. And I'm pretty casual. I'm not really a luxury type high heels, fitted dresses. Um, I mean, I do have some dresses in here, but I just wanted to give you guys a little look. So I'm not going to do shoes. I actually hurt my knees, so I might be limping around here as I'm showing you these things. But I'll start off with what I have on right now, something casual. This is just a nice little black blouse. It is... Um, like a I don't know what material this is but it has like a little loop down here in the middle I'm getting a little weight so it's a little snug on me right now but it's okay I'm gonna be back in shape soon you guys um I do have these nice linen pants it has pockets and I will probably pair these with a pair of boots like um some like ankle boots like these I actually wore this today to a breakfast networking thing that I went to today with another realtor so yeah so this is outfit number one this is something that I feel like I will wear and I like it. So now we're gonna move on to outfit number two. Okay guys, so this is outfit number two. I have on the same top and this is just a high-waisted pair of yellow um, pants. I love me some yellow guys, I love it. Um, but it's very long as you can see, it goes down to the ground and I can wear this with a cute little over-the-shoulder bag. I don't really care too many purses. I only have one in here with me right now, so I'll show you guys this one. But yeah, I think it's pretty nice and cute. Um, now, if you want it to, it was cold outside, and you want to like mix and match your colors, it's fall. You can throw a little shawl on over it. Maybe not this color, but if I did have one, this works out well, or I actually also have this top here. And you're able to toss this over to kind of give you a more less, I guess showing less skin, if that's what you're into. Um, but yeah, so this is outfit number two. And you can check it out. I don't remember where I got any of these pieces from. So that's gonna be a problem when it comes to letting you guys know where I got stuff from. I'm definitely um, a shop out of my sister's closet. I'm definitely a thrifter and I like to shop online. Not really a shopper into the store type person. So yeah, more than likely anything I have either came from my sister's closet, the Goodwill, uh, Fashion Nova, uh, all those like little Instagram shops, Amazon, and yeah, that might be it. <laughs> All those little Instagram shops, when I say that, I mean like um, Shein and things like that. I believe this actually came from Shein. I have a, a, um, a blush pink one as well. But yeah, so that is outfit number two. All right, guys, so this is another outfit here. So I could have kept it with the first shirt, but I just want to show a little variation. But I love these pants. They are um, like a three-quarter leg pants. I can tuck it in the front and show my little um thingy uh little bow tie here it does untie it doesn't come off but it does untie here but wearing these with like the booties or some just like open toe heels or even flats i'm not really a heel person but we got this here you can tuck it in to um one side if you want you can leave it out you can fully tuck it in all around it just depends on your style and what you are into and yeah so these outfits are, are very casual yet business casual um they give you opportunity to be comfortable you're not being all stuffy i'm not putting on three-piece suits i will do another video eventually um showing you guys like boss babe suit ideas where i'm wearing suits like two-piece three-piece suits some skirts some pants but that'll be later on down the line I'm trying to find some more pieces. I have a few, but I want some more. But this is what we have here so far for outfit number 
30. All right, guys, so I'm all for jeans and nice blouse, um, whether with some boots or some heels. So these jeans, um, not a lot of pair of my jeans have like no hole. A lot of my jeans have holes in them. Let me put it that way. They have slits, they have holes, they have marks. A lot of them are like, these are one of the only pair of jeans that I own. Not the only, but I have maybe like two or three pairs of jeans that I own that do not have any marks in it. So these, like I said, are a little more, more professional. But yeah, they're cute jeans, this blouse, nice pair of boots, um, and we're good to go. So I feel like shoes and accessories kind of make any outfit look a little bit more, um, what's the word? Professional, you can say. So I do have a, this blouse. I have a few other blouses that I'll show you guys um, that you can pair it up with these jeans. All right, so once again, this is another blouse that you can wear. Pretty simple, nice color. With this, I would probably wear it with a blazer or something. I did not bring any blazers in here, but if I did have one, I'll put it in here. Or, like I said, throw your cardigan over top of it. And a pair of boots and a pair of heels. You're good to go, guys. I'm gonna show you another blouse that you can wear with this as well um, to show you some variation. Woo. All right, guys, so I decided to switch up the jeans a little bit, show you a little variation. So these ones, they go to your ankles and these, this blouse, you tie a little bit in the front and you can do the whole little bow tie here. You can leave it untied, just how you feel about it. It's not a cute bow, but whatever. Yeah, it's a cute little blouse. You can wear with some flats, with some heels, but nice and casual for you. Now I'm going to change it into one more top and then after that we're just gonna fly through some jumpsuits and some dresses. These are more casual. Those ones are gonna be a little bit more, they're still casual, but a little more dressy. All right, um, another top here. You can tie it in the front, you can tie it in the back, whichever way you like it, but this top is just very flowy. It allows you to move about with your arms up and down. You don't feel congested and stuffy. But I think this is cute. And I usually just do like a cute little like loose tie in the front and I'll keep it that way. But some nice boots and you're good to go. Now, what I'm gonna do is just keep flipping through a couple of different outfits, let some music play. I'm not gonna talk to you guys too much more going forward. But yeah, I um, hope you enjoy the rest of this video and stay tuned.
guys, that's it for this video. I have a few more pieces on here that I did not, excuse me, I'm getting a little sick too. I have a few more pieces on here that I did not show you. For example, this skirt here, really pretty skirt. If you like any of the pieces, let me know which one was your favorite. Let me also know what's your style. Comment down below, let me know what your style is. Are you more business casual like me? Jeans, nice blouse, some boots? Or are you like glam goddess, hair done, makeup, nails, <laughs> uh heels all day every day what is your style what's your aesthetic let me know down below and make sure you give this video a thumbs up for me guys it would i would appreciate it so much and don't forget to subscribe to my channel more real estate and home decor diy content coming soon i won't forget about my financial video videos either if you've been following me for a while don't worry all that stuff will still be here a little bit and i also have my fitness channel which i'm getting back in shape guys i'm going to do it I'm going to leave that link down below as well as my travel and vlog channel down below. So go subscribe to those as well, guys. And until next time, stay blessed.